important meal of the day. Making eggs for my family. Good morning, Paul. Good morning, Mom. Want a bagel? Fresh from the toaster. Oh, <laughs> big fast. Ah, ow, Mom, ah, it burns. Why would you do that? Good morning, Clara. Ah. Bagel. Ah. Take it off. Ah. Ah. usually happens at our house. Well, not necessarily always with bagels, but it's some food like pancakes, chips, eggs, etc. Clara seems to have mastered it, but me, not so much. Hey mom, can I have Amber over? Sure honey! Thanks. Amber is my bae. But she doesn't know it yet. I mean, I've liked her for years and years now. But it's all been very secretive on my part. So I don't think she knows yet. I hope. But anyway, every time Clara has her over, I always do whatever I can to impress her, whether that be cleaning, baking, wooing. The last one doesn't usually work. But I always think it's worth a try. What do I think of Paul's crush? Well, it's kind of annoying, honestly. I just want to have my friend over without Paul trying to pull some moves on her. And he's such a bad flirt. Just saying. Paul, why are you cleaning? The raccoon's acting up again! You see, there's this raccoon. I don't remember exactly when the problem started, but sometime last week we started hearing the noises. This weird guttural growling noise that just said chills down your spine. And when we went to check what it was, well, we found the raccoon in the backyard. So now whenever we start to hear those noises, we have to send someone out in the anti-raccoon suit with a spray bottle to try and ward him off another day. I'm usually the one who has to do it. my best friend, so of course I love her. And Paul, he's nice. It's just, he so obviously has a crush on me, and it's a little painful. I mean, he's a sweet guy and all, but he just, well, I think you know what I mean. Popcorn for my ladies. <laughs> She's like an angel. This romantic scene describes my love life. Alright, Paul, can I talk to you in the other room, please? Paul, 
I am sick and tired of you coming in and being all awkward and flirty when I have my friend over. Well, excuse me, Clara, but Amber is my love, who I barely get to see. It's like Romeo and Juliet, except minus everything Romeo and Juliet. And we don't die in the end. And... Shut up! I cannot deal with this anymore! Oh, well, excuse me, I am dealing in the cards of love, and I can't have you throwing off my groove. Do you really think somebody like her would like somebody like you? <laughs> Please. I'm sure she's practically swooning to get together with this. Ha! Is that so? Could you just please stop talking? Clara, I am a lover, and Amber is my love. And you have to let me spread my wings and soar like Cupid's arrows with... Ow! My arm. Clara! Do I regret what I did? Not a chance. Oh. Amber, d don't listen to Clara. She's a complete liar. It's alright, I kinda already knew. I just... I don't... I... Dang it! <laughs> Amber? Uh, Amber? Can I talk to you in the other room for a minute? Sure, Paul. Paul, it's okay. It's really not. Paul, uh, are you crying? No. Um, it's, oh, it's okay. Just, just what are you doing? I'm so sorry. It's okay. It's okay. I'm sorry, Paul. Why is that? I just, I feel like I should have been more sensitive and understanding when Clara told me you liked me. No, you're fine. I feel like I overreacted a little bit. <laughs> It's a team effort. <laughs> it is. Hey, did I ever tell you? You have a beautiful laugh. <laughs> I don't know about that. Oh, it's true. It sounds like an angel. <laughs> kind of high standards to me, but thanks, Paul. <laughs> Paul, I feel like I don't really know you that well, but you're a really sweet guy and I'd love to be your friend. And I yours. And I'm truly honored that you have a crush on me. But I feel like right now I'd be more honored to be your friend. Yeah. I think that's good. Now, should we get off this floor? I feel like it's had its fair share of bagels land on it. Yeah, let's. Hey guys, Paul, I'm sorry. No, I'm not. Clara, it's okay. I'm honestly glad you said something. See you guys. Bye, Amber. See ya. Oh, wait, Amber. Don't you want a grilled cheese? No, thanks, Mrs. Parker. I'm fine. No, honey, sweetie, take it to go. <laughs> no, Mom, not again. So what happened with Amber? Well, we really just talked it out. Honestly, it was much needed. I'm glad. Hey, Paul, I'm sorry. Nah. Still not sorry. Uh, I shouldn't have acted the way I did. It's fine, Clara. I understand. I shouldn't have been so disruptive. So, a fault on both parts? <laughs> Definitely. Hug it out? Hug it out. Uh, there. <clears throat> um, Clara? Clara? What? What is- Ow! Ow! Ah!